Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's look is a part of the I Am Freedom Awards. I'm now in the top 20 thanks to your guys' vote and this is our second challenge. So the challenge was Hollywood Glamour versus Modern Icon. I decided to do a Modern Icon look inspired by Kim K. She is definitely well known for her smoky eyes, especially using the bronzy shades. So carry on watching if you guys would like to learn how to recreate this look and don't forget to vote. The link will be down in the description box. So first I'm using the concealer palette and I'm applying that all over my eyelid as a base for eyeshadows and then I'll just go ahead and blend that in. All the products I use, the names of the products will be down in the description box. Now using a matte cream eyeshadow, I'm going to set that concealer so it doesn't crease. This also helps my eyeshadows uh, to blend more smoothly. Going in with this bronze blush palette, I'm using that matte bronzer as my transition shade. And I'm really smoking that out and I've also applied it along my bottom lash line. I'm then going to apply a little bit of that contour shade and lightly deepen the crease just a little bit. Next going in with this bronze metallic shade, I'm going to apply this all over my eyelid and I'm also going to lightly blend that through my crease just ever so slightly and then I went in with a little more of that bronze shade that we use as our transition and I just use that to blend the edges so there's no harsh lines. Using that same bronze shade, I'm just going to smoke this along my bottom lash line as well. Next going in with this matte dark brown, I'm going to deepen the outer corner of my eyes and a little through the crease, just making sure everything blends well into each other. To highlight the inner corner of my eyes, I used that gold shade which was super pretty, it had a really creamy foiled uh, texture to it. Now I'm going to coat my top and bottom lashes with this mascara, nothing too dramatic because I will be applying false eyelashes. So these are the lashes I'll be using and they are super fluffy and really wispy and I just got these from eBay. Starting on the base, I'm applying the strobe cream for a subtle glow. Then I also mix these two pro foundations to get my correct color. Um, also, I do like to go a little bit dark with foundation as well. So I've gone ahead and applied that strobe cream all over my face. And then for my foundation, I use my beauty blender to apply this all over my face. Next I use the yellow and neutral concealer from the Stroh palette to highlight under my eyes, down the so, uh, so sorry, down the sides of my nose, the T-zone and also a little under my contour. I then went in with this bronze cream shade uh, from the same palette and I applied this around my forehead and then I also went in with that darker contour cream shade and I used that to contour my cheekbones a little around my temple, jawline and my nose. Boys. 
Now I do like to blend my contour in first, so I'm using this Duro Fiber brush just to blend in my contour. I do like to switch between this and also my Beauty Blending sponge. So once I've done that, I'm going to use my sponge again and I'm just going to go ahead and blend in all that concealer. For highlighter, I'm using the lighter shade from this blush palette. I'm going to highlight down my nose, the high points of my cheekbones, my cupid's bow, T-zone, above the brows, pretty much everywhere. So now I'm going back in with that bronzer that we used on the eyes earlier and I'm going to use that to further bronze my cheeks and also to enhance my contour. Lastly for the face I'm going to mix these two blushes together to get a peachy glow. One was matte and one had a little bit of a shimmer to it. To finish off the look I paired it with a nude lip. I'm just filling in my entire lips with the uh, nude lip liner so you can use any that you have. Then I want to go ahead and apply this pro gloss which has easily become a favorite of mine. It's super creamy and it's a really pretty nude color. So this is my completed look for the I Am Freedom Challenge 2, a modern look inspired by Kim K. Voting does start now, so please go ahead and vote for my look if you like it. I believe you can vote up to three times, so I will leave a link down in the description box if you guys want to vote. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video.